Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, the White Oak, Pennsylvanian toy collector, and it's time for another Eddie Hill review. It's review time, people. And today, we'll be reviewing the some DC figure action. We got this blind box figure of the Flash, and this is from a line... Made by Justice League, something or another, toy line. And these are some good looking little figures. I got a whole wave of these, like Wonder Woman, Green Lantern, Batman, Superman. These are mini HMF series figures. I like these so much, I might have to pick up their Wonder Woman. Because this is just a good looking figure. And their Green Lantern. But before we look, look, we're look, we looked at the packaging. Now let's look at our figure right here of the Flash. Not a bad little figure of Flash, so he can go fast, running fast, and be like, whoo, whoosh, speeding fast. Articulation is really good on these figures. I absolutely like them. And his fist can go pew, punch, punch. But he does get a couple pairs of open hands. As you can see, it's an option. But given I can't remove them on the afraid of breaking this Flash figure, I'm not going to bother removing them. But otherwise, it's a really good DC Flash figure, and I'm so glad to have another Flash. But now, for comparison, here is the... Flash figure of this blind box series next to my original DC Justice League Flash. Not a bad comparison. That's all there is to say for Flash comparisons. So we did that. Next on the list we got is the Batman movie. Batman from Ollie's. We got this for three bucks and the other thing we got for four bucks we got these both for four dollars at ollie's when they had them get a nice product shot of batman himself and the mystery decoder card bunch of other stuff if you want to read it that's all there is to say for the package in, let's look at this decoder card thing. And it looks like it's the Batmobile. This holographic red piece shows the hidden image. So when you put it back in here, you can see an image. Which is pretty cool with this. I actually dig it. So let's get this back in here and show you the hidden image in this artwork. It's Batman's Batmobile. And here is our new Batman figure from the Batman. He's got his grappling gun. He's got a batarang in hand. Articulation is really good. No hinge at the elbows. Oh, wait, there is some hinge at the... Uh, elbows ain't that nice we get some hinges i love some hinge figures so we get them in a lot of different poses i love this figure would i highly recommend this guy and the flash to any other people who like dc action figures yes i love some dc superhero figures whenever i find them and these I highly recommend. If you can find these figures, pick them up. They are worth the money. And I got these each for four bucks each, which ain't too bad from Ollie's, if I do say so myself. Are these worth adding to your DC collection by anyone else's standards? I think they're worth the money and adding to my shelf. And I highly recommend to anyone else, if you can find them, pick them up. You won't regret it. But now for some other comparisons. Here's another Batman. Next to the Batman movie Batman. 
Here is the Batman missions. Mr. Freeze Bat Jet Batman. And that's all there is to say for this video. If you like this video, please make sure to like. Please make sure to comment. And don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this. And this is Eddie Hill. Moving on and rock on and rock out YouTube land.